so dear student today we will be discussing the previous year question of electromagnetic waves okay the first unit so let me share the pdf yeah so find the force i think uh, i'll share the screen on that I think now the screen is visible. So find the force on a 100 microcoulomb charge at 0, 0, 003 meter. If four like charges of 20 microcoulomb are located on X and Y axis at plus or minus four meter. Okay, so first thing in this kind of questions, we have to know the formula used. Force, one by four pi epsilon naught. Instead of one by four pi epsilon naught, I'll give 9 10 power nine, correct? into q1 q2 by r square is a normal formula in the vector form what it is r cube into rip okay so this is nothing but my resultant vector by r cube this is one formula which you are gonna use it so 1 by 4 epsilon naught values 9 to 10 power 9 and this q and q is already given in the question that is 100 microcoulomb and 20 microcoulomb and just find the radius. So since it is that axis, it's very, very easy for me to find it. Correct? And uh, if four like charges of 20 microcoulomb are located on X and Y axis, at plus or minus four meter. Okay, so X and Y. Fine. So first thing is zero, zero, three. Either X and Y. So first thing is what I have to put for R1, P, this 0 minus 4 into i cap plus 0 minus 0 into j then 3 minus 0 into k for every l for every r the result in the radius what i'll be getting minus 4 i plus 3 k in the sense the magnitude value will be same magnitude is something but what root of square of this square plus this square so 4 minus for the whole square plus 3 square so we know 3 4 and 5 are triangular numbers so for everything i'll be getting what answer as 5 only so you can directly write on this thing root of 4 square plus 3 square so if you're getting the question i don't want you to even write r1 p or anything directly you can write this magnitude okay which is same for everything r1 p is equal to r2 p is equal to r3 p so once i'm getting 5 that 5 i'll put in place of this r, r cube and come back to the question 100 microcoulomb is of charge 1. That is my Q1, Q2, right? And second one is 20 microcoulomb. So that is the two things which I'm going to substitute here. And if I do it, I'll be getting the answer. Okay, so I'll be getting the answer here. That is 1.7. Just simple substitution. Okay. And the second question is, a charge lies in the z is equal to minus 3 meter plane in the form of a square. And they given the range. And this is my rho s, correct? Which is given by the 2 into x square plus y square plus 9 whole power 3 by 2. Nano coulomb. Find the electric field origin. In the sense that 0, 0, 0 I have to find. So first thing is I will be using the formula. which I will show you the formula which I want to use. This is a formula. D is equal to 1 by 4 epsilon node in the rho s dA by R square. This is the unit vector R cap. That is R vector by mod R. This is a formula which I'll be using. So just look at it. This is a formula. And rho s is given in the question. 1 by 4 epsilon, let it be like that itself. We will not substitute 9 to 10 power 9. Because it originally they asked. OK. And this they are given the plane z is equal to minus 3. So surface element x, y minus 3. So distance of the origin is what? Root of x square plus mode. Mode means root of x square plus y square plus minus 3 the whole square. This x square plus y square plus 9. Now the r vector, r cap. r cap is nothing but what? r vector by mode r. Correct? r vector by mode r. So in the sense 0 minus x. I, 0 minus y. That's only they written down here. 0 minus minus 3 plus 3. So minus xi plus yj plus 3k by root of x square plus y square plus 9. That is the root of what? 
the mode of the value, the magnitude value, that is always root of x square plus y square plus this, whatever we're getting on the top. Then substitute this R cap where, where I showed you the, this R cap value is there, right? This set to substitute. And one more thing, a radius value. A rho s value is also given the question. 2 into x square plus y square plus 9 whole power 3 by 2. That is already given in the question. This is my rho s value. Okay, we are just going to substitute everything. So once I am substituting 1 by 4 epsilon naught, it can do rho s value. And this is x square plus y square. This is also the whole divided by x square plus y square plus 9 whole power 3 by 2. And it is on the dx dy because it is on the z axis. Okay, and this is nothing but what? My r cap minus xi plus minus yj plus 3k. This I have to substitute here, which I have not written completely here. Just simple substitution. Then what I'm going to do is this element, this will be cancelled. Let me see whether I can draw it. This will be cancelled. These two things will be cancelled. Okay. Yeah. And this two also I'll cancel it here. Once it is done, two to sub four. Two to sub four. So that's our final answer for what the D electric field. This answer I'll substitute in what to find total electric field. Minus xi plus yj plus 3k dx dy by 2 pi epsilon. So whenever you get these questions. So the shortcut for this is, see here, yes. you can see here this minus x i minus y j plus 3 k, right? The same thing will come by 2 pi epsilon naught in this dx dy. That we are going to integrate with respect to the limits. Minus 2 to 2, minus 2 to 2, that's it. And only z component value is there. So x component, what is electric field? 0. You need not even integrate. Okay. And y component also is 0 because only z is given. That is 3 by 2 epsilon naught. It should be 3 dx dy. Right? That 3 only I'm taking it out. And you should know what is integral of dx. That is x. So 2 plus 2, 4 will come. Again, 4 will come. 4 into 4, 16. 16 threes are 48. So 48 by 2, 24. The answer is 24 by pi epsilon naught. Here also 2 I'm cancelling with this 48. That's how we're getting 24 by pi. So you have to do it. Then only you'll be able to get the answer. But the shortcut also, I told you what it is. This one, the unit vector. How we are getting this? The distance from the origin. 0 minus x, 0 minus y, 0 minus minus 3 this by 2 epsilon naught it is a shortcut so that you have to remember so even if you are not writing all of these things it is fine i need a direct electric field formula then total electric field then you would write what each component as i have written x component y component and z component respectively that's all okay. thank you